we're looking at a lot of different ways to speak about what life is, and some of it is seems kind of radical. And uh, I guess we call that non-duality, let's just say. But other kinds of teachings are more logical. And uh, a logical teaching might be that uh, if you're having a bum day, what's the chance? You know, let's just say that there are. And time is real and past is real today and tomorrow is real. Let's just go by conventional wisdom. But even logically, I mean, if you're having a bum day, what's the chance of you having a better day tomorrow? I mean, out of a bum day comes another bum day, right? And somewhere the chain has to be broken. If you're happy and joyous today, I mean, what's the chance of your ha being happy and joyous tomorrow or in the next moment? It's probably pretty high, you know. <laughs> At least you're on a roll, you know. <laughs> I mean, just get straight logical without any kind of interior knowing or anything, you know. I mean, uh, and then so many teachings just say it's up to you to kind of break the chain. You know, you've got to just look and see, you know. Uh, maybe we're talking about positive thoughts and negative thoughts, but uh, what, I mean, another part of the te teachings will say that, you know, who's, who can control your next thought anyhow? If it's negative, it's negative. And there's truth to that, too. But, I mean, just to realize that it's not getting you anywhere, uh, except in deeper in a pit, it's a pretty big realization. Um, often, to me, it sounds like we're moving from being unhappy, and if we follow a path, we will end up being happy. You know, that, that seems to be the thought. I, that's not been my experience. It's more, it's more like the waves that just that roll, and then they go down, and then they go up, and they go down, and they go up. And to me, to let go of the idea that it's going to be a steady climb <laughs> up into the clouds of, you know, heaven and bliss you know that's just i mean it's a great story and maybe it has worked for some people but you know not 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 me something enters in to change everyone's life and we can call it whatever we want you know the divine or or awareness or god or or your 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 favorite uh, guru, whoever it would be, something comes in, but just life itself comes in and kind of shakes things up. And when that shaking up happens, therein is the possibility, back to the medicine wheel, that out of that placement of difficulty, there will arise some kind of urge that moves you to go to the next placement on the wheel. And I, this is how I see life. That it just, we get moved. I mean, let's not, we can talk esoterically, who is we and where are we going and so on. But my experience is we're trying to stop hurting. 